I haven't made a Uniqlo video in a while and there's good reason for that. They haven't really released anything new that I've been that excited about. Even though I haven't been buying stuff from their more recent drops, I've still been buying more of the items that I love from their permanent collection. And because these basic items from Uniqlo play such an important role in my current wardrobe, I thought I'd make a video talking about my favourites. You may already own some or most of these items, but if you don't, then I can't recommend them enough. If you do enjoy the video, please feel free to leave it a like. I'll leave links to everything I talk about in the description below. And now that's all out of the way, let's get into the first item. So the first item on the list, and it's an item that everyone probably already owns, but it's the UT. I've been wearing these for years now, and they're a great affordable t-shirt that you can wear all year round. This is down to its mid to heavyweight build, so it's gonna keep you a little bit warmer on those cooler days, but it's still not gonna make you overheat on the hot ones too. Yes, this isn't the most soft t-shirt that I own, so if you're on the hunt for a soft t-shirt, this is probably not the one for you, but I don't mind that at all. I absolutely love the fit of these t-shirts. They have a slightly relaxed fit, but nowhere near oversized. A timeless cut in my opinion. The collar on this t-shirt is where this t-shirt really shines. It's really nice and thick, and it holds its shape really well, even after multiple washes. A decent neckline is really difficult to find on a t-shirt. A lot of them lose their shape even after the first wash, even on more expensive t-shirts. So they're not the softest t-shirts in the world and they're not the best t-shirts in the world. But for £9.90, they're a great basic to have in your wardrobe. And for the price, they're gonna be hard to beat. Next on the list, we have their long sleeve pocket tee, also from their U range. These t-shirts are an absolute lifesaver for me and I can't praise them enough. If I don't know what to wear, I normally just whack one of these on. I wear these for casual daily wear and also with a pair of smart trousers for evening wear and I've even worn them out for a run on those colder days. Because they come in a heavyweight material that's thick for a t-shirt, they're perfect for those cooler summer days or for summer evenings. You can layer them over the top of a t-shirt to wear them more like a sweatshirt or you can wear them underneath a sweatshirt for some extra warmth. There isn't many ways you can't wear this item and that's why for me, this is a must have in my wardrobe. Next up, we have another beautiful item that I wear far too much in my wardrobe and that is the premium lambswool cardigan. I've got three of these cardigans now and they're another item that you can easily wear both dressed up and dressed down. In the warmer weather, I like to throw one of these over the top of a vest or a lightweight t-shirt and in the colder weather, they're a perfect layering piece underneath a coat or a jacket. I'm actually waiting for one of these to arrive today in the light gray colorway, so the doorbell could go at any moment. If it does, I'll show you a sneak peek on camera, but if not, I'll show you in a future video. You can usually find these in the sale this time of year as well, because not many people wanna wear a cardigan in the summer, unless you're me. So you can pick these up around now for an even more affordable price. So if you're looking for a really simple and versatile cardigan, then this is a great option to go for. The next item that I wear all the time is their basic hoodie. They do bring different colors out in these, but your black, gray, and navy, I think, maybe a couple of others, seem to always be in stock. I always take the drawstring out of these hoodies. I think it gives it a much cleaner look, but it's up to you how you wear it. The quality on these for the price is absolutely amazing and they do fit me really well. I absolutely hate a floppy hood on hoodies. I think it lets a hoodie down, and luckily, this hood stands to attention, it's got some volume, so it definitely doesn't have that problem. But I wear these when I go out for long walks, when I do exercise, I wear them underneath jackets and coats, and I even wear them with a pair of shorts. So again, a really versatile item to have. It's got a nice thickness to it, it's really, really comfortable, and for the price, you're gonna have a hard time finding anything that beats it. The next item on the list is their basic sweatshirt. I love the slightly relaxed and slouchy fit of this sweatshirt, it has a bit more of an unstructured look and it's really, really comfortable. This slouchy and more unstructured fit might not be for some, so if you prefer a more slim fitting sweatshirt with more structure, this might not be the best option for you. I have this sweatshirt in black and also in dark green, but I'm thinking about picking up the oatmeal colorway as well. These come in at under 20 pounds, so the quality you get for the price is absolutely amazing. But I wear these for lounging about the house in, for faffing about outside in, and I also wear the black one sometimes dressed up with a smart pair of trousers for an evening out. Now, some of my favorite items from Uniqlo are my coats from Uniqlo, but sadly, the coats that I've got from them, you can't pick up all year round. As this video is all about my favorite items from their permanent collection, that's the reason they're not in this video. Also, you may have noticed there's no trousers on this list, and that's because I haven't had much luck with them. 
I like a lot of my trousers to have a taper down towards the ankle, and I find a lot of the Uniqlo trousers don't have this. Some do, but most don't. I am aware that Uniqlo do have tailors in some of their stores, however, I do all of my shopping when it comes to Uniqlo online, so this is a luxury that I don't get to make use of. But for me, Uniqlo really excel when it comes to the top half of your outfit, and they are one of the best stores for basics out there for me. All the items I've had from them have held up really well, and I wear them pretty much on a daily basis, so you definitely get a lot for your money. Out of interest, let me know what your favorite item from Uniqlo is in the comments below, and also let me know what you don't like from them. But if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a like. If you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe, and I'll see you all in next week's video. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. See ya.